Hello, Clint from the Clint from New York to Virginia channel. When somebody says the term GMO, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? Is it food? The O in GMO stands for organism, genetically modified organism. The commercial practice of cross-species genetically modified organisms were being produced about 30 years ago. That's when it was introduced commercially for the purpose of controlling crop pests. About 30 years ago, a disease emerged called Lyme disease. There are more diseases that will be emerging soon. A fungus slash protozoa known as Funnelformis mose up until last month, the only known cases of infection of this fungus was to plants. Last month, the first documented cases of Funnelformis mose were found in two hearts of persons that had passed away. Confirmed human infection. And although not implicated as the cause of death, it's been documented, and I'll link you below. Just this past week, a brave doctor, Dr. Stephen Fry, held a conference in San Francisco. Many doctors who want to know what's going on attended this conference. The presentation that he gave at this conference is going to blow your mind. Using next generation sequencing of DNA, he discovered that this Funnelformis mose has DNA of protozoa, fungus, and unknown DNA. The last I checked, a protozoa does not mate with a fungus and produce offspring. If you send me your email, I'll be able to authorize you to see his slides from the presentation. This is a must see. This genie cannot be put back in the bottle and you must know about it. Do what you can to keep your immune system healthy and God help us all.